If you have diabetes, either type 1 diabetes or type 2 diabetes, and you follow the dietary advice of the American Diabetes Association, it may harm you more than you know. This is Dr. David Dahlman for AskTheHolisticDoctor.com. I meant what I said about the harm that the traditional diabetes diet can do to you. Today we're going to talk about diabetes and stay tuned because we will discuss a much healthier diet and some natural supplements you might want to consider. What is diabetes? Diabetes is a condition in which the body either doesn't produce enough insulin or it has become resistant to it. There are two types of diabetes, type 1 diabetes and type 2 diabetes. Diabetes information can be very confusing. These diabetes types are treated differently with type 1 diabetes care involving diet and diabetes medications, while type 2 diabetes care usually centers on just diet, although diabetes medications may be involved. Diabetes discussion about both types of diabetes must include dietary advice. According to the American Diabetes Association statistics, there are 20.8 million children and adults in the United States, or 7% of the population, who have diabetes. In order to determine whether or not a patient has prediabetes or diabetes, they can ask their physician to conduct a fasting plasma glucose test or an oral glucose tolerance test. Either test can be used to diagnose prediabetes or diabetes. The American Diabetes Association recommends the fasting plasma glucose test because it is easier, faster, and less expensive to perform. Type 1 diabetes is usually diagnosed in children and young adults and was previously known as, previously known as juvenile diabetes. In type 1 diabetes, the body does not produce insulin, a hormone needed to remove glucose, which is a type of sugar, from your bloodstream and move it into your cells where it can be used for energy. This means that any foods that you may eat that break down into sugar and everything that is not a protein, fat, oil, nut, or butter breaks down into some amount of the sugar called glucose. This sugar will remain in your bloodstream where it can cause many health problems. It's not just pure sugar we need to worry about. It's foods that break down into a sugar called glucose. Type 2 diabetes is the most common form of diabetes. It's also called insulin resistant, resistance. It's a condition where you are probably producing enough insulin, but the cells of the body don't accept the glucose that the insulin is bringing to them because you are probably eating too many foods that break down into sugar. Your cells have seen so much of it, and they don't want any more. So they're resistant to accepting the glucose, and what happens? The sugar remains in your bloodstream. Your blood sugar goes up and has negative effects on your energy levels and may also hurt your eyes, kidneys, nerves, or heart. While diabetes occurs in people of all ages and races, type 2 diabetes is more common in African Americans, Latinos, Native Americans, Asian Americans, and Pacific Islanders, as well as the older population. The good news is that a proper diet and an all-natural supplement program can positively affect both types of diabetes. I have two other videos, one about type 1 diabetes and another about type 2 diabetes, where you can learn about a diet not recommended by the American Diabetes Association that can help you regulate your blood sugar more effectively and prevent heart disease, as well as the other common conditions diabetics are prone to experience. Controlling diabetes is well within your power, so apply all the discipline I'm sure you have in other areas of your life to reduce the amount of carbohydrates you're eating and manage diabetes more effectively. I'm Dr. David Dahlman for AskTheHolisticDoctor.com. To view more videos about holistic approaches to other chronic health conditions and read my opinionated blog about many health topics in the news, please visit AskTheHolisticDoctor.com.